All right, welcome to these next lessons on math review. This set of videos is going to be on rational expressions. We've got the definition right here. Any expression that can be expressed as a fraction. So it's just the same as a rational number. Now, what does that mean? Consider x plus 2 can be written as 2x plus 4 over 2. Because I can factor the top and I'd be left with that. Even something like x squared plus 3x minus 6, I can rewrite as x cubed plus 3x squared minus 6x over x, because I can factor out an x at the top, and then these cancel. So rational expressions means more factoring. So that's why we're doing these after the quadratics video. Let's say we had x squared plus x minus 20 over x squared minus 16. And you were told to simplify. What do you do? First factor where needed. In this case, I need to factor both top and bottom. Bottom's easy. Difference of two perfect squares. I've got x plus 4, x minus 4. The top, it's going to be x plus 5, x minus 4. Then, cancel out like terms. Those two are the exact same, so I can cancel them both out. I'm left with x plus 5 over x plus 4. And that's my answer. All there is to these. Now we're going to do one more example. And it's going to be similar to the one we just did. x squared minus x minus 20 over x squared minus 25. Same process. Factor both top and bottom. And I'll have x plus 4 times x minus 5 over x minus 5 times x plus 5. Alright, this is the only reason why I did this one. I could have used the last example to do it. I'm just going to do it on this one. See these two here? Those two do not cancel. All right, I've seen a lot of people reduce that to negative 1. So x minus 5 over x plus 5 does not equal negative 1. The only way that these would reduce is if you had x minus 5 over 5 minus x. This equals negative 1. 
So this and this are the ones that cancel. And now I'm left with x plus 4 over x plus 5. All right, that's the only thing I wanted to bring up. They look, as, they look similar, but they're not. And that's rational expressions in a nutshell. Uh, next video, we're going to be doing a little bit more of advanced factoring stuff, and I'll see you there.